For Cyclones TV, I'm Nick Brunker with the head coach of the Cyclones, Ben Simon. A couple of new defensemen added to the 2013-14 fold, Brett Weissopel and Drew Daniels. First on Weissopel, a guy who has some teammate ties, Mike Embach, and he played at Ferris State University. More about that in a minute, but first, tell us about this type of player. What's he going to bring to the blue line? Well, he's a smaller size defenseman, but again, a very good skater, and he, he has to be a smart player to make up for that lack of size, but uh, he competes. He's a competitor. All the research I've done on him is that he competes, he can play hard, he, he skates, and he uh, he goes to the hard areas. Is that type of, of play for a defenseman like that, when you mention his stature and his size, how does he have to change the way he plays to make him more effective? Well, I don't think he necessarily has to change his game. I think he's had a lot of success in college and last year over in Europe uh, with the way he has played. Uh, it'll be a little bit different this year on the smaller ice back to what he's used to in North America, but uh, I think he's off to a good start with his pro career last year. and. Looking forward to get started over here. You mentioned Mike Embach and he having ties at Ferris State University. You talk about the transition from college to the pro game, although he's had a year overseas to kind of make that adjustment. Uh, having a guy that you're familiar with, does that make it easier to come and play pro hockey? Yeah, I, I think it makes a, a big difference. When you have a, a friend or a buddy who can kind of help you through the transition and you know, he's familiar with the city, can help him kind of get around and get acclimated to Cincinnati. I think that only help him. Drew Daniels is a guy who also has some college experience. He played at Northeastern University, was an assistant captain there at a time, also a champion of a year ago with the CHL's Allen Americans. Tell us about the type of style of hockey he plays. Well, Drew's a bigger body. He, uh, again, can skate very well. He was a former NHL draft pick by the San Jose Sharks. Uh, can play physical, and uh, we're looking forward to him uh, using his wheels and uh, playing physical for us. Making that change from the CHL to the ECHL, you talk to different people, and they say different things about the difference between that league and this league that the Cyclones play in the ECHL. Explain, is there a difference in your opinion, and if so, what is that? Well, hockey's hockey. I mean, it's the same game since you've been growing up, but, uh, you know, to be honest, I haven't seen the, the Central Hockey League, and, you know, I, I've excited to see what uh, what Drew can do. Hockey's hockey and he can skate and he can play physical so he'll, he'll be just fine. With those players on the roster now you're getting closer and closer to the beginning of the season. I know your schedule is going to get a lot more hectic as the weeks go on. Not that it hasn't been already but you're about to jump on a plane and head down south for Florida Panthers and Nashville Predators prospect camp. Tell us about that. Yeah it'll be good to get down there and, and watch hockey and talk shop with uh, a lot of good hockey minds and just kind of get in hockey mode where uh, we'll have the opportunity to see some guys that we might see later down the line here and It'll be a good experience. Enjoy the trip. We'll see you soon. Thank you very much. That's Cyclones head coach Ben Simon. I'm Nick Brunker, and this is Cyclones TV.